Okay, this is a video going over the PowerPoint, some of the uh, concepts of the PowerPoint. So first thing I just talked about is a little bit about the central limit theorem. Now, if you have a, a distribution, no matter what the shape is, another square one, if I pull out random samples, and I take the average of those samples, right? Let's say we're going to focus on this one. I do that once, twice, three times. I start plotting those averages instead of the individual leadings. What happens, no matter what the shape of the original uh, distribution is, it'll end up normal. Now, this is important when we start figuring out probability. Now, one of the key things I, I want to point out is as we take out more and more samples, this average will hone into the population uh, average. So what I do is, to measure that variation, instead of using the individual standard deviation, I do the standard deviation of the means. So it looks like that. What I do is take the individual standard deviation and divide it by the square root of my sample size. In the case of the uh, PowerPoint, the individual standard deviation is 1.23. I had a four-piece sample. And if I do the math, it comes out to 0.62.